Andy Katz here for NCAA Digital March Madness Men's Basketball with our latest bracket. Now that college football is over, all the attention should turn to men's basketball in advance of the NCAA tournament. Here we go. New bracket to start the new year. Our one seeds, Houston, Kansas, Purdue, Alabama. Our two seeds, Arizona, Tennessee, UConn, and UCLA. Our three seeds, Gonzaga, K-State, Texas, and Iowa State. Our four seeds, Xavier, Virginia, Miami of Florida, and Arkansas. Significant among those top four lines, first off, Kansas State and Jerome Tang. Off to a great start so far in the Big 12. Of course, we've got some familiar names and a couple of teams that maybe weren't projected to be there in the preseason like UConn, Iowa State, Xavier, doing great job so far early in the season. Some notable seeds in our bracket. Five, North Carolina, played for the national championship last season. Providence, also a five seed, didn't have a bad loss in the non-conference, but not a significant win, playing great basketball now atop the Big East. Duke has slid back as a six seed. Missouri, under first-year head coach Dennis Gates, as a seven seed. Clemson, not ranked and no one talking about them, yet they are top the ACC under Brad Brunell. They are an eight seed. Nine, Northwestern. Chris Collins has done a great job revamping their defense with assistant Chris Lowry. Northwestern with wins over Illinois at home at Michigan State. And then this past weekend, at Indiana. A couple of 10 seeds. New Mexico under second-year head coach Richard Pitino. Kentucky, which is sliding in the wrong direction as a 10 seed. And College of Charleston, just ripping up through the CAA. They're also a 10 seed. The last four teams in our field, NC State, West Virginia, Creighton, and Utah. The first four out, Wake Forest, LSU, USC, and Utah State. Digest it, debate it, more to come this season.